Coming at you from the land of post commentary, this is What a Geek doing solo commentary. I'm replacing what was originally on at this point because let's just say there was a there was one individual who is known in our apparent scene who doesn't play the game, only ever bashes the game, and always brings a melee setup. So you can imagine what the commentary was like before. Can't say I'm gonna be any better, but anyway. Pepe versus Shotties. I believe this is losers quarters, if not losers semis. Uh but the point is they're both in losers bracket. Now Pepe is very very known for being a Ness and a Jigglypuff player in a local scene. Shotties is known for giving those tips very generously to his servers. Pepe manages to land the PK Thunder right on top of his head. Back throw. Not go gonna take it, doesn't look like. Chase him down with the PK Thunder. Excellent dodge by Shotties. Now what Shotties gonna wanna do is break his shield, footstool off of him a couple times to throw him off, and then break his shield again. Pepe, I believe, is opting not to go for Jigglypuff in this matchup because of the shield breaker. Nice uh, efforts by Shotties to keep Pepe off the stage. Going for the counter would have worked if not for the... I guess that those would be iframes for the PK Thunder. Back there manages to take him out, though. Pepe waiting for that invisibility to go away. Shotties doing rather well getting damage off on Pepe. Opting not to go for the counter again, knowing how it didn't work last time. And neither of them are going for the balloon, which is upsetting. Pepe had a very clear disadvantage percentage-wise, but Shotties is slowly starting to lose that. Looking for some more tips coming out from Marth. Still nothing. Pepe going with a fantastic grab game, as always. Solid up air from Pepe could take this stop, or rather, I was looking at the percentages wrong. Man, I'm distracted. And or bad at commentary. Could be one of the two. Goes for the counter again. Didn't land it yet again. Could be because Ness was ledge snapping at the time, though. Uh, ooh, that push away from the sour spot of down air is going to take that stock from Shotties. Pepe hanging on rather excellently. ESP Kirby coming out full force without just without the bat. Well, with the bat. Well, whatever. Point being, ESP Kirby has the hat. I pretty much. I think I went over this on a previous commentary. This is being recorded on a Tuesday, whereas the tournament happened on a Saturday, so I got a few days of uh, not looking over the footage that I have to make up for. Pepe managing to. or not managing to. Pick your words carefully. Pepe choosing Jigglypuff now. Probably not too scared of the shield break happening because of the infrequency that Shotties was throwing him out. Probably also going for a lot of offstage gimps, which Pepe is also known for. At least for Jigglypuff. Ness, maybe not so much. Shotties going in with some excellent jabs into smashes. Doing well to keep his space. Speaking of space, you can see the stars. Nice air dodge by Pepe coming in with a landing up air. Here's the offstage game, and there goes Shotties. Just poke the balloon. Poke it with your sharp sword. Not with the broadside, because you won't pop it that way. Ooh, nice trade of blows there. Tip forward air, not quite enough to take out Jigglypuff. Which is surprising nonetheless. And the nice air dodge into rest, taking the game for Pepe. Shotties, unfortunately, I believe is knocked out. So, good efforts nonetheless. And as he applauds with that staring face of his, showing no emotion... Jigglypuff's just happy about it.